this is a great tool to add details in your images afterwards uh, when you're upscaling i guess so this uh this is another workflow which is upscaling uh, with the detailed daemon node i'm using line sigma because i come to the com conclusion that this is much better and it's a very tiny node so i'm going to use this I'm using this on ast is 0.5 uh, 0.05 in negative uh, start percentage is 0 0.2 0 0.9 you can use 0 0.1 whatever you want uh, case sample select is tpm 2m uh, i'm using a upscale node because i'm using a ultimate sd upscale node which is a custom sample okay that uh, please uh, because you want to use the sampler uh, as a input so you need a custom sample you can just search it ultimate custom yeah as the upscale custom sample okay this is i'm uh, upscaling two by two and uh, using eight steps because i'm using uh where is it um let me use laura for this okay so i'm using uh, flex dev turbo uh, for upscaling eight steps one cfc same settings like this beta 8.4 denoise make sure the whole uh, the uh, they both have the same uh, steps and uh, denoise uh, denoise values and i'm using upscale model super scale forex and mkd super scale sp 17 1 lakh 78 thousand g so you can find this also in the description yeah pretty much it and i'm using this image so yeah that's it and let's see i mean let's compare the images look at these details wow ba, 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 wow of course you can get details in uh, using uh, ultimate sgf scale but uh, know this because uh, uh, but think about this because i'm using 0.4 denoise in if i'm using 0.4 lots of details can be changed here because the images where we are using uh, you if you want a consistent image like lots of similarities uh, in the output uh, you have to lower your denoise level uh, like 0.15 to 0.2 or 0.25 to get the same image with some details but we're using 0 0.4, 0 0.4 and as you can see with the detailed daemon the, the details are amazing here right This is a great tool to add details in your images afterwards uh, when you're upscaling, I guess. You can combine this with other LoRa's also if you're using uh, detailing LoRa's like um, uh, the Flux Detailer. Uh, combine these two and you will get a really detailed image. So that's it, I guess. That's it for today and I hope this video helps you. If you find this video helpful like the video comment and share also if you are new to the channel subscribe and i will see you in the next one this is a great image